What is the most important thing that these kids can get out, get out of it? By seeing you and talking to them, what do you think they can get? I don't know, probably not my words. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. Uh, I always thought any exposure you had to uh, guys that played the game of baseball was, uh, was a positive. It made me want to learn more. It made me want to watch the baseball games more. Um, so, uh, you know, you think about all the games, great players now. You got uh, Manny Machado from uh, Baltimore. You got Bryce Harper. You got Mike Trout. All those guys, if they have a chance to meet a kid, um, they have immediate impact on their interest in the game. And so hopefully, I'm an old guy now, and uh, they have to go uh, Google me or uh, go look me up. But I think uh, maybe it'll spur an extra interest in the game. Maybe they want to play it a little bit more. Um, I hope that's the case. Is there an honor in being a sports marshal? Is there an honor? Uh, yeah, it's uh, being recognized. Um, I had a wonderful career. Um, I got to live a dream. And uh, now, now you get to look back on it. And uh, so, so uh, being noticed and being remembered, um, I think is a good thing. So yeah, it's, it's a it's a great honor. Let's talk a little bit about your son. Let's hear your son's son about five minutes out from the station. What's that like watching him go through going through the minor leagues? What is that like watching? Well, I mean, he started uh, with an injury, and uh, and so he missed uh, pretty much a whole year because of uh, surgery to his ankle. But it's good to see him uh, experiencing uh, guys that throw consistently hard, guys that uh, have really good breaking balls and change-ups, and they can mix them in and accounts. Um, it makes you feel a little powerless because uh, when you were playing, you had some sort of power to impact what happens. As a dad, you kind of cringe and you're watching. It's, it's way more nerve-wracking for me to watch him than it was for me to play. But... Uh, He's enjoying it. He's going through the, uh, um, the ups and downs, the struggles, and uh, some of the hot periods. Um, and it's all necessary to, to learn. And so um, I'm happy for him. I, I don't get a chance to see him as much. I saw a game in Hagerstown. I saw a game in Delmarva. Um, I plan on peeking at him every once in a while. But part of the growth and development is for him to, it's his space. It's not necessarily my space anymore. What kind of advice do you want? Um, my, like my dad said, it's a new day every day. Keep working at it um, and keep getting better. Uh, the challenges are in front of you, and you have to meet those challenges each and every day. But it really is a one day at a time sort of uh, proposition. If you start to think about the results um, um, and you're trying to, be, to drive for those results, you forget about the process. And it is about the process, and the results will come when you start to learn. Let's talk about like, the state of baseball. Where do you, where do you think the state of baseball is? Oh, I don't know. Isn't that the commissioner's job to actually talk about the state of baseball? I think uh, more people are enjoying baseball. It seems to be as popular as ever. People are watching it on TV. The attendance is, is up. I get glimpses into the grassroots of baseball quite a bit from our businesses, and it seems like the game's in a good, healthy state. The kids are honestly uh, enjoying the game. Um, I know part of my job, uh, I have a job now with the uh, commissioner's uh, office to uh, advise him on youth baseball. And uh, we're trying to get more kids to, to play the game. We're trying to make the game a little bit more fun. We're trying to present the game in, in different ways. And I'm happy that Major League Baseball has taken a role in that. Um, uh, baseball um, has lost players to football and lacrosse and other sports. So it's kind of cool that uh, we're presenting it to them and trying to get more kids playing. What about the state of the O's? Where do you see them going this year? And what, what, do you, what about their future? Where do you see them at? Well, I mean, uh, the O's are a competitive playoff team. I think when you start the season out in spring training, everybody thinks that they're a competitive playoff team. But in reality, the Orioles have uh, you know a good offense. They got a good defense. Uh, uh, they have a great bullpen. They have some depth in their uh, starting staff. Some some question marks in their starting staff. Uh, but um, their overall baseball decisions have been really good. And you got to play out the season. So you can't project. I don't know if anybody can project a team from spring training and say that they're going to win the whole thing. Um, you have to go out and play it. You guys want one more thing? These guys want to get us into crisis. I apologize. Oh, well, um, last thing on the sun. I know you've taken a peek at their roster yet. Denver, yeah, I see that. And Rick, is that, is that strange? Yeah, or? It's it's interesting, and it's uh it, it um, celebrates uh you know the name, but in the end, those kids are just like every other kids without a name. Um, they're trying to compete, they're trying to find themselves, they're trying to prove whether they can play or not. So I know with my son it seems like the expectations uh, have been high all the way through, and I wish I could remove that sort of burden from him, but I can't. He has to deal with it. Uh, 
Mariano's kid, Bucky's kid has to deal with the same thing. So um, in the end, we forget they're their own people. They're not, they're not us. They're their own people, and they have to carve out um, um, their little niche. And so I wish I could remove some of the pressure and some of the burden, um, and some of the heckling that happens in the stands, but uh, it's all part of their development. So um, I'm happy to see that, uh, that they have a chance to play pro ball, though. Yeah, he's a bigger kid than me though. Yeah, he's a bigger kid. He's a bigger kid than me though. Yeah, 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 he